Welcome to Fred Knock. My name's Rob. My name's Colton, and welcome to the Entry Level Metal Team. Hey guys, uh, thanks for tuning in. If you don't know anything about this channel, uh, we have went out. This channel's went out and we purchased entry level guitars uh, after doing tons of research that we felt like you could buy at a really budget friendly price that will actually be decent guitars. Mm -hmm. So all you need to do is go to Fretknot One or go to Fretknot Guitar Reviews, either both on YouTube, and uh, get on the page, find one of the guitars that's in a giveaway, like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and then type the words D-O-N-E into the comments under the video, and that puts you in to win a guitar. Yep. Welcome to Fret Not. My name's Rob. My name's Colton, and welcome back to the Entry Level Metal Series. Hey, it's good to be back, man. It's uh, We've got something for you guys tonight. Good news, bad news. So just hang in there with us. Mm -hmm. um, we've done a lot of stuff to the channel. We've been able to work on some stuff on the backside. Um, and uh, what are you holding? It's a Harley Benton. And I don't remember it's the model. Amarok 6. Amarok 6. BKRD. We've done a lot of Harley Benton's. I know. <laughs> so this is way outside. It's not expensive, but it's way outside of our normal entry level. I saw the specs on this guitar, and I uh, had actually somebody on the channel suggested that we get it, and I bought it, and uh, we're going to review it for you tonight. Um, <clears throat> and then we've got stuff to talk about on this guitar. But before we go any further... I want to go back to the other guitar that we're doing the modding on. We got a couple of day delay on the pickups. We thought we would have that mod video for you Saturday, but it's not looking like it'll be till it'll be the next week. Uh, but we got the guys on it. We're going to make sure that guitar is really nice for you. Make sure you go on there, man, and look at that guitar, that IYV. Get on that drawing. It's going to be a monster mm -hmm. when it gets done, and it'll be done here in next week or so. So because we try to stay on schedule, we went ahead and ordered another guitar, um, and it'll be here in about 36 hours. And so this weekend's video, we will have a guitar to put up, um, so a review to put up on something else, and something else for you guys to freaking win. Yeah. So cool. hopefully you watched the first part of the video. You already know all the stuff that goes on on this channel, and uh, we want to say... Uh, Welcome to everybody that's new. Uh, mm -hmm. Thank you to our members. Our membership is live. Yep. If you can get involved in that, we do have separate content, some separate content for the members. Uh, we will be trying to do, as we get a few more members in there, we will be trying to do some specific drawings for the membership. Um, please, if you can get involved at all and help us, it's great because the more you guys help, the better we, you know, the better guitar we put out. Yes. So this guitar is an Amarok 6. It is a um, mahogany body. It has a flamed vape maple veneer neck. So, hey, at least it's wood. Um, it's got a five-piece neck through body neck on it, and it's just freaking gorgeous. Check that out. Um, I've seen a lot of guitars. I own a lot of neck throughs. That's done incredibly well. Mm -hmm. um, it's got an ebony fretboard, a high-end ebony fretboard. It's got uh, white inlaid dots on it. It also has the uh, glow-in-the-dark dots on the side. It has stainless steel frets. The fret work on this is really good. Um, good. It's got a natural wood binding around it, which is really cool. Mm -hmm. uh, they did the matching headstock the same way with the veneer. Um, it does have a graph tech nut and it has two EMG retro hot 70 ceramics. So um, these are actual EMGs. Um, they are active um, and they sound good really thing. good. Mm -hmm. And it has locking tuners. Uh, we're going to get into price point where we got it. Everything to do with it here in a minute. Um, the first thing we want to do is talk to Colton because this one's on you this week. You're not playing an X. Yeah, no, not another X. I got two normal bodies in a row. Yeah, right? So what do you think about this guitar? How does it play? It's a lot of fun to play on, and it sounds pretty good. Um, there's some stuff that we'll go over that, you know, might be nitpicky, but, mm -hmm. you know, it might be something worth knowing. You know, you might appreciate that. But all in all, it's a blast to play on. It sounds great. Um, I always, I you know, I always bring up, 
fret buzz or anything like that, you know, because I feel like that's important and I don't really get that on this one. I'm sure if you tried to tune it to lower tunings, you might pick up on some of that, but in anywhere from C to, you know, drop C to drop D should be fine. Yeah, it's in drop C now. Mm -hmm. And you played it this week on the deal on the live, yeah. so what do you think? I mean, it's it's pretty good. I like it. It's got it's got pretty good tone. Okay. Yeah. All right, so what we're going to do right now, we gave you kind of an abbreviated on this. We have a lot to talk about on this guitar, so instead of keeping you, we're going to do what you want us to do most. We're going to shut up and let you hear this in a mix. Okay, we're back you got to hear it in a mix you played it yep you like it i like it i you know there's again there's the nitpicky things but overall it's a pretty good guitar okay just so everybody knows this guitar is about 500 bucks um it you can get it for a little cheaper if you buy it from the uk uh but we bought this from the harley benton usa shop it's like 29 bucks higher but you're not paying that shipping it's not going through customs blah 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 so it's worth the 29 bucks. Told you at the first, we got good news and we got bad news. We originally bought this guitar thinking it was going to be a giveaway. Um, as of this moment, it's not going to be a giveaway. And let me explain to you why. Um, when we got this guitar, all we did was tune it. It plays amazing. I gave you a little sneak peek on one of the other videos and I told you this is my favorite. And I think all in all, unless maybe... And I haven't played any of the $499 uh, uh, PRSs. I don't know, for our style of music, I don't know if you get a better guitar with all the appointments mm -hmm. for what you pay for this. Yeah, especially that neck. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah. And it, and it feels nice. So here's the, here's the issues with the guitar. A, um, all the appointments are on this on this guitar are extremely high end. They're what you would expect on a twelve, fifteen hundred, two thousand dollar guitar. That doesn't really uh, it, that doesn't affect. I mean, it, it doesn't really translate to the volume and tone knob. Um, they're very mushy. Yeah. Um, they continue to spin from zero to ten. You know, you get on either side of those numbers, it still spins. Mm -hmm. um, another problem this guitar has is the jack. When you plug the guitar in, if you move it much, it, the, the input jack will just fall out. It'll fall out. So we, I contacted uh, Harley Benton USA. I haven't heard 100% back from them what they're going to do about it. Um, here's the options on this guitar. Uh, if they decide not to do anything about it, we'll probably fix it ourselves. And if we do, we'll put it into another video. Um, but right now, I'm not comfortable as much as I love this guitar, and I think it's, you know, probably hands down the best on the market out there for what you pay. Um, I'm not comfortable giving it to anybody because it does have issues, even though I guess the volume and tone and and the jack do affect playability. But well, not the jack certainly can, yeah. <laughs> 
if you're playing in uh yeah it, it will fall out and um i don't know if they just skimped on it i don't know about the controls i haven't had a chance to take it to my luthier but i'm gonna have him look at it and um i'm waiting to hear back from harley benton to see what they say but man if you got one of these and it didn't have those two problems you got a gem yeah this is uh i mean it's got a tusk nut locking tuners uh, stainless steel frets, neck through body, EMG pickups. Uh, I, you know, I really, uh, that's 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 pretty good for five hundred bucks. It really is. And it was like five hundred bucks shipped to the door. I think five eighteen or five nineteen shipped to the door. And remember, if you're doing anything like this and you're in the continental United States, make sure you go to Harley Benton USA. It's a section of reverb. Um, if you can find one on there, man, you get out of having to do anything across the pond. So that's always a great deal. Mm -hmm. And I, I do, I dig the color on it. It's, it's pretty cool. It, it, it reminds me of one of my guitars and I really like my guitar. So. <laughs> All right. So there's one, two, three, four, five guitars on the channel right now that you can win. Uh, we'll be giving another one away this weekend and we'll be putting another one up. And then the week after that, midweekish, hopefully we're going to have that, uh, uh, IYV modded for you and it's going to be up. We've got a uh a really nice little guitar coming in this weekend <clears throat> uh, we're going to do a video on that mm -hmm. and uh we're going to put a little bit of extra stuff up on the members side so if you guys want to jump in on that it's cool if you're not we understand it's no big deal um am i missing anything i don't think so i, w I know we're still working on like how we really want the memberships to kind of function so you know what you're seeing there might not all be there you know we might have some more stuff uh, uh, as an option available later but as of right now you know hopefully we got enough to make it worth it for you yeah we've got some stuff up on there right now and we're trying to put up more um we're we've got some things coming down the pipe here in the next couple weeks we just met a new luthier and uh we're gonna hopefully if everything goes right we're gonna get a guitar from him and hopefully we'll get to interview him so you guys on our other series on the high gain series can check that out too mm-hmm Yep. So we're working on a lot of stuff. Uh, we thank you guys. We appreciate everything. All you new, all the new people in here, man, uh, just hang out with us. Uh, this is the norm for us. This is what we do. Um, we bought this guitar in a way to give it away. Mm -hmm. I just can't see giving it away with the issues. And honestly, if I give it away, Harley Benton's definitely not going to do anything for me <laughs> if I don't have it. You know what I mean? So we're going to wait and see on that. So tonight's video, there's not a real reason to comment done on this one. I mean, you can if you want to. I, mean, I don't care. Yeah, we but appreciate a comment. We would appreciate Whatever it. Whatever you want to comment. And if you've got comments on if you've ever bought one, or if you bought another one and you've had any kind of issues like this, um, you heard this in the live. You heard it in the mix. It plays and sounds amazing. But I don't know if you'd want to get on stage unless you duct tape that jack in. Yeah, I mean, the knobs let's be honest, or will most of the time stay at 11. I know <laughs> there's no 11, but you get it. But, uh, That's true, but it bothers me when I turn it to 10 and then uh, the internal stop and the, the knob kind of yeah. keeps turning. And I was like, ah, oh, that's not good. Yeah, but the slightest bit of jumping around or, or you know, a, you know, a knock or a bump or something, it will likely fall out. It, it, it happened to me a couple of times, but, you know. So let me say this before we get off here. This is a smoking deal. If I had to go over there and put new pots in it and a new jack on it for 500 bucks with all that stuff I just told you, that's a smoking deal. And I dare say, I don't know if there's another company out there that will build something to this quality level. There's not a mark on this. There's not a blemish on it. I mean, it's done really well. It is. Um, I just, I don't know if there's a better buy out there at 500 bucks. And of course, the ones we got to give away would have a couple of little dinky issues with it. So. Mm -hmm. I'm just still, I'm, I'm blown away by the neck for, for that kind of price. You know, there might be other stuff out there, but normally, you know, for at least, especially for like what we've given away for around that price range, it's you know, most of the time all bolt on and. Well, and uh, it's not only that it's bolt on, it's that, you know, the necks are kind of an afterthought other yeah. than them being on, attached to the guitar. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of times they just, they feel cheap. Mm -hmm. They don't feel substantial. They don't feel like anybody really done a lot of time with it. It's like yeah. they pushed it through a machine. It came out. It was the bare minimum. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And you do have a neck yep. and it does play, but 
over time, you really want something like that. That's yeah. a that's a lifetime guitar. And yep. It's five hundred bucks. Five hundred bucks, and and not to say that there's anything really wrong with bolt on. It's just you know there's there's a tier system. You know when for what you're getting for the price you're paying, and yeah, and uh, it's just it's just that price for just hey, that some beautiful of my favorite, looking neck. Some of my favorite and most expensive guitars are bolt ons. Mm -hmm. I've got I've got a couple bolt ons, but some of my as expensive are neck throughs too. Yeah. I'm a neck through person. I like neck through. Uh, I just am. But anyway, all right, listen, guys, thank you so much. We're humble. We appreciate mm -hmm. you. And until next time. Stay tuned.